do it. You scrolled on this video to do it. Oh, I like that! Welcome to Steph Reacts. We'll be reacting to the Kelly podcast. Let's go. They will be talking about Monique versus D.L. Hewley. Let's find out. If Preston was there, now it's Lou exaggerating. He doing extra shit. You feel okay? We are. Hey, hello, hello. <laughs> We, we don't win. We there. Yeah, we we there. It's the Cali kickback. You understand me? <laughs> Lewis Belt. Y'all talking about? Teddy Ray. Teddy Ray. Oh, and yeah. we got motherfucking Precious Hall Y'all back in the know. building. Y'all you know what saying? What up? What up? What on up? these hoes. <laughs> One half <laughs> on these hoes. <laughs> we got me. half, but I, I brought y'all gifts. Whoa! Sonny Boy gonna wear this. <laughs> on these hoes. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Oh, I'm gonna wear this. I'm not gonna lie. Precious look like she's cool as hell. To the lesbian club. <laughs> oh, what, what, what? Yeah, on these hoes. Nah, I'm going to wear this on butch night and they're going to think I'm a butch bitch. I Shut like up. them. They I like the titties them. and respect me. Shut up. That's hella funny. How you feeling, Precious? Man. We were you just talking about hella shit. Yeah. <laughs> I know. For I real. got a ride we up. The whole show right How here, are you dude? doing? <laughs> At the end of the day. I mean, I'm all right. I'm just, you know, on some girl shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm. What's that time of the month? Just one of them. Now I'm waiting on it to come. And I'm not waiting. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was supposed to come yesterday. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? According to the period tracking. I'm sick of period tracking. The bitch used to be accurate. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Now mm. this bitch be throwing me off. It's Ooh. a nigga out there knocking your period off. Shut up. Ah. You can knock it off a day or two. <laughs> <laughs> you can knock it off a day You can knock it off a day You can bring it on down That's no. hella funny I'm so juicy Niggas ain't got periods boy. Cause I be buzz Motherfucker I start bleeding Man, Man so I, Out I of know, nowhere Right And right? this traumatizing shit Where she just expecting I know it's coming she at the moment. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, like but, you just waiting on your dick to bleed. <laughs> That's <laughs> crazy. I know. Bruh. And I got to go get a man pond <laughs> a Put man it in pond. the tip of my dick Nigga and just let it sit there all day until it, I'm done. It really is crazy. And my attitude been on zero, too. I was telling y'all. Mm -hmm. You need a Snickers? She, how long is your? Uh, <laughs> Not going man, anywhere man. for a while. Let me oh, see. Nah, no, I'm just playing. Nah. You know? I'm chilling. No, I feel good. I went and got my nails took off. I'm finna start fasting on Monday. Mm -hmm. Because... Um, it's just time. You know, I, I just been on for real. Yeah, it got. I gotta hit this fast. You don't want to do it with me. No. What you pass it off of? Just everything. Or I, I'm a drug, y'all know. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Weed, okay. I little. thought you were talking about food <laughs> and shit. Oh, yeah, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And then the beef and pork. You know what I'm saying? No beef and pork. No swine. No, no. Um, and we're gonna do chicken and then the seafood. You know what I'm saying? For oh, thirty yeah. days. I just saw this one picture. I took, somebody took a me and I was oh, like, God. You damn. don't want to be fine off that corporate in that cabbage. <laughs> uh, no, you can't. I ain't gonna lie. The streets been saying Precious got that, that thing. Being nigga, you said that. <laughs> <laughs> We all said it. We all said it. Practice got through that couple. I don't care if you come with a couple yeah, pounds. Stupid. No, everybody, we was here. Yeah, that's the attack of presence. Uh, <laughs> we just did. We just did a show. Oh, yeah. Niggas chasing her. So I'm like, all right, bro. I had to make. I'm like, you straight? I was going to the niggas back up, bro. Be cool, bro. Let her do her shit. I'm dead. God yeah. damn. Cause she get on stage and get to talk of what that dick do. Yeah. I mean, a lot of niggas that really want to show her. Have you have you said that joke since? It... It's been a while. I, th yeah. I did. I think I did it in London. Oh, okay. You know what that's saying? good. Oh, that's, yeah, yeah. that was cool. But I hadn't done it in a minute before. Yeah. That, you know Keep what I'm saying? saying that shit. I really oh, How was mama. the London show? The London show. It was different. Because I heard it was. A, <laughs> <laughs> now it was cool. It was a hassle, kind of getting back. Woo! Hassle is an understatement. Damn. These hoes are slow as a as a unit. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. <laughs> like Mira, physically we slow. Missed, like we missed two flights. It's no way. You know what I'm saying? So I'd be spooked if I missed first, two flights yeah. out the country. And then you know it's a big time difference. So it was just like the second day. Like I, we should have been headed to the plane. And I, I wouldn't know what I would do if I ever missed two flights. To be honest, I would be afraid. 
I'm thinking about the time we arrive. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All day I'm thinking about the time we You I, can't look at the time the flight depart. You gotta look at the boarding time. <laughs> it was just whatever time is boarding, you gotta be there an hour and a half, two hours before that. I hadn't been that stressed in a long time and I lost my phone in the midst of it. But it came back up. But Damn. <laughs> it was just so much drama, y'all. I'm like, man, I just came here to work and go home. But this turned into a home. was with you. Yes. <laughs> God and how many females do y'all be on the road with? It was just me and her. Oh, okay, that's cool. They, that's why she said well, they slow. Yeah. That's a unit. Nigga, uh, two okay. of us. One of us should have had. She like, I'm used to you having it together, so I just... <laughs> 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 that's why the world will never... <laughs> Somebody got to leave. Dick got to run shit. Yeah. But nah, it was no, cool. Play, I want to go back to London. They talk is different. You know what I'm saying? We I talk different them. and different shit. So it was cool. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't the show I wanted it to be, but it was uh, cool. You know what I'm saying? Like the women love it. Right? Yes. Yeah. But then, you know, y'all know I do that other one, that joke too. And then after the lady told me, most of the dudes out there ain't circumcised. Oh, wow. swear. And y'all know how hard I go down now. Damn. But it was good. It, it, I mean, <laughs> Damn. I should do more research. <laughs> Yeah. That, well, a yeah, lot of countries. Yeah. It was cool. That's like the garlic yeah, festival shit I was talking about in one of them episodes. Like, now I ain't know y'all ain't had garlic shit. festival. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't know. You know what I'm saying? It's like everybody yeah. got they, like, they got strawberry festivals. Yeah. Like, you gotta just find that out. With just, that's just cool with traveling yeah. and doing shows in it different do. cities. It even and just states. they talk is different. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Even when we ask for help, I'm, they like, yeah, you gotta go to the lift and do this. I'm like, we gotta catch a lift? Mm. And they, but they talking about the elevator. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh. And so they got just different <laughs> shit all the ranges. <laughs> you looking for a car and shit. I'm they like, talking I gotta about catch elevator. a lift. Biscuits is cookies, ain't it? That shit is crazy. I fuck with the London ain't uh, a, ain't females. A a cookie? I oh. met a lot of them in New York. Say. They be on me. It's beautiful black people there. <laughs> and the accents, you know what I'm saying, oh, are amazing. And it's just, it's beautiful. Mm. The black people. And the white people, they was nice. Okay. What's up with y'all? Uh, nothing. I'm feeling good. You are. Ted, you feeling good? I'm oh, feeling uh, immaculate. I feel you feel me? I, I'm excited. I uh, we got press in the building because uh, excited to be here. Congratulations, yeah. hosting the show, doing your consistent show in the Bay, right? Yeah, yeah. You, understand me? you gotta come up here. Yeah, I'm yeah. telling you, they need, they want you up there in the town, <laughs> man. I'm talking about. I know we got to show up there in August, but I got to come there before. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Just mm -hmm. get a little light work slide through the hood, instant me. Already, already. But, yeah. you know, shout out to your people you know, and your Yeah, mom's, mom's pops. You know, we here every Friday at Rob Biz from 8 to 11. You understand know, me? Get a plate, me. see something great. Yeah, oh, man. Oh, uh, I wanted to ask y'all about the, uh, how y'all feel about the uh, Monique and D.L. Hughley shit. Because, <laughs> uh, you know, Price is a woman. And I ain't want to talk about this shit without having a woman. But the press is the right woman to talk with this too. Cause you see what I'm saying? She can really close out some shows, and niggas mm -hmm. will not want to follow her. And be Facts. Like, I just seen her go through the politics. Facts. Shit, you feel me? So, mm -hmm. nigga. <laughs> I just said the uh, show we did. I'm like, she one of my favorite comedians, and not female yeah. comedians, just, just comedians, comedians in general. Yeah. That I, matters. Yeah, she not no oh funny female. No, nigga, she better than a lot of these niggas. Man, <laughs> I love everybody. I just seen Crunchy <laughs> rip and be like, <laughs> niggas got and she a beat a lot of these niggas up too. You can tell how precious. <laughs> Her little physique and how she moves, she just sock the shit out with me. Wow, Oak Cliff! <laughs> sock you and say Oak Cliff. Yeah, fuck that. No, Monique look that. like that too, though. Monique looks like she can Baltimore. fight. Don't yeah. play Monique like she just. Baltimore. Uh, yeah. No, for real. And I, love, I just love the way she stand up for herself. She always mm -hmm. stand up for herself. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So you got to appreciate that in the mm -hmm. world where everybody just be behind the scenes, mm -hmm. you know, talking about shit and it never. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? And so you think that shit is true? About I mean, like uh, with what she fighting for with the black women? She saying black women don't get the same opportunity or same treatment as black men well, in the see, entertainment Well, see, I thought business. she was fighting for the, at first. You know, I thought it, the issue was about the headlining thing. You know what I'm saying? It was about that <laughs> initially. So before I ask you about that, how you feel about that, Teddy? Because me and Teddy been touring together for years, and we always like, co-headline. Yeah. And I don't It'd know. Be, Nick, we done damn near like rock, paper, scissors sometimes. <laughs> like, who's gonna go last? Like, Facts. Either we just don't care, 
Mm -hmm. Or like, let's say when we was in Dallas and mm -hmm. I knew your people was there. Mm -hmm. I'm like, you gonna headline tonight? Cause yeah, this is that's me. All your people, when we was yeah. in Houston and all her people, I'm oh, like, my yeah, mama. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Like, yeah. If your situation, all my people there. Yeah, I'll when your mama there, it's like, yeah, hold on, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mom's you know, here, nigga. You gotta shine. end this yeah. shit. <laughs> your family was like forty percent of the show. So yeah, Oh, mama, shout out my whole family too. The Woodberries and the Belts and everybody. But see, that's why it would have been cool if they had that camaraderie. You know what I'm saying? Cause y'all got But that's how you know They don't talk to each other That's another thing She went on stage To attack I feel like she been Wanting to say that Cause she said something In her video about Him saying Stuff about her before Oh Fox I feel so They don't have That camaraderie Like the Other cast members Especially those On Roast Me You see that Everyone there Is like family So What he just said Is Fox though Fox Okay. So it's like you kind of she kind of came to the show with this. Yeah. Do headlining matter to you, Precious? Uh, that no. check matter. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I ain't tripping. That's why I said I can walk in and go up first. Mm -hmm. show. You know, I ain't tripping. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's pop this shit off, man. But we in a different position, though. We younger in the game. Mm -hmm. Exactly. We, we, they like, you know, like she said, she's been I doing it 30 you. plus years. So, you. you know what I'm saying? And then, you know, they both had, I guess they both had their paperwork that said, but I don't know. It's just she crazy. had Dia Higley fucked up though. She said you open for the kids to come. I, I don't <laughs> close for the kids to come. <laughs> she said I don't open for no goddamn body. I said go on <laughs> That was say, funny. Say, she didn't give a like, fuck. Say, she came out busting on Neo. I said, oh my God. I fuck with DL Higley. That's one of the OGs that I don't have a relationship with. I ain't really chop game with him, but I'm a, I'm a fan either, of DL Higley. Me too. You know what sure. I like about so, him? Uh, go ahead. Go ahead. No, you go ahead. I was going to say, he just had that style where he come out and attack the crowd. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Like, right, man, he could just boom. Mm -hmm. Look at this. Boom. You know what I'm saying? And I like that because it's a whole. Thing. You know yeah. what I mean? That was half his uh, Shit on King's the Comedy set was roasting Roasted. the crowd. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, my mama. Yeah, DL a legend. I think these are both legends. They mm -hmm. are. I respect both of them. I love mm -hmm. both of them. Mm -hmm. Monique, I just want to see her win. You feel me? Yeah. Really win. Like, you, you think know? she burning too many bridges with people? Because uh, at the end of the day, I think with that situation, <laughs> hearing both of their sides, uh, <laughs> they posting the contracts and all that. Um, I think the promoter was the nigga that was janky. See, so now that's the, the middle nigga middle we got to beat up. Yeah, that's the yeah. Mm -hmm. He done told everybody they the one. Yeah, and then you get here and you got to figure that right before you. And go. that would be and, a problem if you don't got a relationship with somebody, I guess. And you know yeah. everybody ain't gonna let all these people down after they done paid their money, so somebody got to go. Right. But they both did forty five minutes. So what is the what's the headliner if they if y'all doing the same time? You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Headliner is just the nigga that go last. That's all I tell Straight. myself. Yep. It ain't I'm like just a nigga going last tonight. Yeah, ain't, yeah, because she did forty five minutes with. and he did forty five minutes. And if they, because it seemed like they was a her problem was about the money, so it seemed like it was about ego. Oh, and that's what I was thinking too. It was, you know, was it the money? Had she she never mentioned yeah. the money. She was just saying, "What the fuck I look like opening up?" For no, no she was saying the contract she signed. Same she was headliner. Head liner. Yeah. See, that's yeah. she, that's where I think people's getting to Mister Screw. Mm -hmm. And then my Higley paperwork was say with... I go last. Mm -hmm. Your paperwork say you go last. Yeah. So so what the a... fuck? Yeah. Who who agreed on this? But what that? Yeah, the person that gave them the paperwork should um actually come out and say something, but uh. We'll wait and see if we have any more news on that, though. That'd be a problem. I think it probably is possible to... Would it be a problem if you didn't have a relationship with somebody? You obviously wouldn't have to respect their craft, huh? I still... I think I still wouldn't trip. You know what I'm saying? We yeah. both at the end. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I think I still wouldn't trip. If my... Y'all got my money right. Bro, niggas mm -hmm. really... Work. But I don't know. You know, that th 30 plus years, people work hard for that shit. That's like a doctor. Don't call me my normal name. You call me a doctor. Fool, I went to school... A lot of extra right. years for that. You that's, know what I'm that's saying? That's a good point. And I'm a vet. She could, she, she could retire. You know what I'm saying? If this was regular work. Yeah. So you got to put some respect but on that. But like, hold on, on bitch. I'm a doctor, too. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you calm your ass down. We both doctors. So true. who finna this do this nigga surgery? I got surgeries? two number one books <laughs> on the best time show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I be on some political shit. She's like, I'm working out and shit, nigga. Like, what? We both do some shit. I don't know, but... 
I hate it. I hate it came to all that. Yeah, you know I don't like. Saying? I don't. I didn't like to see that. It was weird too, cause I randomly just posted Monique clip like a few days ago on social media, and I'm like, you did just shout her out. I just shout her out out the blue for no fucking reason. Yeah. I just some in my heart was just like, man, Monique don't get the credit she deserves. Funny, and even right then on that clip, she got a standing O when she yeah, left she that bitch. Yeah, she was funny. Bitch. That shit was like, funny. You seen the clip? Say that shit was standing funny. standing O when she left that bitch. Yeah. That run had me laughing. Say. <laughs> <laughs> when she ran across the stage. But D.L. went dumb right after that. Because he, that showed experience. Because you ain't finna bash me for hella long. And then he roasted her ass. That's how you know he matured. He's like, I'm going to roast her ass for one minute and get into my set. I'm yeah. not finna argue with Monique. Because yeah. <laughs> at the end of the day, that's a woman. Exactly. I'm not finna. I'm going to say what I got to say and keep it pushing. Mm. I'm not finna. Have a. You could feel that. Um, when pre um, pre when Teddy said that Precious felt something. <laughs> War of words yeah. with you. But you she know. on this mission about fighting and speaking up for black women and not getting the, getting the opportunities that, you know, that they deserve. She kind of feel like she supposed to be getting treated like Dave Chappelle and D.L. Hughley and them. And she kind of feel like she don't get treated like them because she a woman, even though she done the same work as yeah. them. Accolades and everything. Yeah. So, at the point of your career, do you feel any differences of how men get treated versus how you get treated? I mean, I mean, it's differences. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all have an all dude show in a minute. You know what I'm saying? Mm. And I feel like they throw a token bitch in there just to, you know, <laughs> for the equal opportunity. <laughs> Usually. <A token> bitch. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It don't matter ethnicity. But, but you know, we got to have a freshers. token. No, Maybe I'm. We, we done tried to give women chances. <laughs> <laughs> Some of them will come up there and bomb. Terrible. But it's a lot of these niggas that be coming here and bombing, too. Come these up. niggas be ass, bro. Man. And I'm not saying it like I'm just a raw ass comedian. Right. right. Right, because you feel you know, I'm not coming from shit. that, nigga. Yeah, we, we all be all ass on our yeah, nights. Yeah, Don't yeah, we get it twisted, but I'm saying, like, yeah, but bitches be ass and niggas be ass too, though. Everybody so. be ass. Everybody ass. Yeah, some any given day. Any given any night. Any given Sunday. Yeah, <laughs> that's my shit. Any yeah. given night. But it's, it seems like it's more, it's just more male comedians than female comedians, do you think? Because that's what I feel. Hmm. And it's a lot of women that lead a game, like, They'll be comedians for a little bit. Then mm -hmm. Go do something else. Go do something else, you feel mm -hmm. me? Or have a family or then mm -hmm. come back, nigga. Mm -hmm. You know. Niggas will really lead a family, nigga, to do this shit. Like, yeah, nigga, like gotta go get it. See you when I see you. I, I yeah, had told Craig. Any niggas I know that I'm like, I didn't even know you had kids, bro. Yeah. <laughs> For real. You been out here ten years, nigga. It's your second time going yeah. back home to see your kids. Yeah. You left the family. You didn't move them. It you. was all niggas at the show. Uh, what was what was what was the past holiday? <laughs> holiday. Uh, Memorial. Memorial yeah. Day. I'm like, you niggas ain't got no family, nigga. <laughs> I'm like, nigga, I'm here because I'm the young nigga. I ain't yeah, got no family, old, nigga. Working, nigga. I'm in L.A., nigga. My family from the Bay, I nigga. Like, yeah, I was thinking about pulling up on you, nigga. <laughs> yeah, nigga. So, you feel me? It's like, you That's know why I'm not these niggas out here, bro. I'm like, I really go to my family house, nigga. <laughs> on Memorial Day. Rejuvenate like. my spirit, nigga. I don't got to sit around you. Not for Vampire real. Vampire spirit in that. No, it was a lot of real. dark niggas there. I'm like, y'all niggas need to find a bitch or something. Not for real. I be at my people. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't even in this industry. <laughs> Say, right up the street, food chilling. Say, that's, and that's good. important to have people in your life that's not in the industry. Because mm -hmm. it's like, that, yeah, it that, gets, you always got to have something real to cling on to. Man, you know? they are like my family admit, for it real. Can go, it can, it's here one yeah. day and gone the next. Like, yeah. You can really be... They can love you one I, it's night. There's a lot of people one out here I've never Young seen go home. Up arenas, nigga, I see like you go home. Down. Yeah, You be putting it on your story. I'm like, okay, I fuck with that. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. Chilling with pops. I be noticing all this. Y'all be like, y'all be looking at a lot of niggas. I don't like, even be posting. Y'all be just saying people. cities. I never see y'all in. Nigga, that matter I to know. me. I don't post them much no more because, you know, <laughs> I'm really sensitive. <laughs> right. You know, but I do but a we little. We comedians, you know, though. Yeah, a lot of things are happening. But, um... Try not to post too much of your real life on social media because you have too many weird people out here, so be safe. You gonna yeah. try to talk that shit. Right, but, uh, but I feel that shit is important, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro. daddy got my damn nerves, though. That nigga there. <laughs> Boy! Hey, I fuss with your dad, man. Boy, we done got that that to, nigga was funny when I was watching shot that to shit. <laughs> he had a different state on each bottle. <laughs> <laughs> you, want, you want this Arkansas? I got this Missouri moonshine. <laughs> 
I got I this. Was thinking, uh, <laughs> say, I was thinking about like when we was young, like you would maybe hear about one, maybe one or two like kids who got 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 a gun and like did some shit. But like we knew exactly where the guns was, like right in the closet. You know what I'm saying? Like they right here in the corner. We never was like. Go fuck with the guns. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, we did the toy shit with the, like, spray and the little light. And you know what I'm saying? We, yeah. nigga, broke the back doors playing wrestling. Nigga, we done did everything, but we never was like, go get them guns. Now, nigga. The, world, like, the world has changed. It's crazy. Like, right? I'm thinking, they didn't never talk to us about it or nothing. It was just there. Like, it's y'all just, know about it. Nah, <laughs> nigga, that's. <laughs> you know, not to yeah. fuck with it. Like, yeah. and now it's like, every other day we hearing about a damn. Mad well, that's shit. That's just niggas' parents is their kids' friends now. Yeah. Oh, you used to fear your parents a little bit. Facts. My daddy is like, if it just would have been say, uh, uh, yeah, you, yeah, you gonna now get your niggas shit. is like, I see the uh, TikTok of these kids mm. tearing their mama house up every day. I said, my mama would never. Uh-uh. Yeah. Oh no. Never oh, no, just let her like cause we kids. Yeah. We just get to tear shit up, nigga. And she got to clean all that. shit I think up. a lot of motherfuckers get shot too cause these pranks. Motherfuckers, this pranking is a thing too. Like think- only people used to prank was jackass and shit like that. Now motherfucker, the they average. They want to do it to go Joe, viral. Yeah. You gonna fuck around, and really get shot? Stop playing with yeah, I everybody. I saw that one little girl in the bathroom. What? Oh, Lord. Oh, <laughs> Never mind, too heavy. Shit, nigga. You are <laughs> hella funny. I'm the one brought it up. No, this, 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 this no, generation you know. is odd. I, I, Memorial Day was different, too. No. I ain't seen nobody eat a rib about this motherfucker. Ain't, I, I ain't seen. You had a rib? I know your ass had a rib. <laughs> <laughs> Me too, I had a rib. Duh. I'm trying to spread the love, nigga. I, was... <laughs> I am real, but I got some steak and some chicken and some lean. Uh, uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and some motherfucking. Oh, we for sure. My whole Probably generation was in and Miami and, and Vegas. Yeah. That shit was crazy. Man. Everybody's out I there. I see the post like, our generation don't barbecue for shit, nigga. Yeah, like that. For dang. real. We used to really come up. What happened? Barbecuing, nigga. Shit, you start barbecuing. But me and my homies barbecue. That that ain't we we oh, different. Moms. But yeah, I know a lot of people that. But I'm 30 too at the same time. No, we young OGs. Yeah, you know I'm talking about. So, That's some young OG shit. My mama barbecue and my daddy would do the grill shit, like the charcoal shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. She set the shit up. She barbecue that shit. That was man shit growing mm-hmm. up. You're supposed to help your pops. Yeah. Facts. Grab mm-hmm. them coals, shake it, <laughs> make it even. Mm-hmm. I don't even like cooking on them new uh, grills. I don't like them yeah, grills. The gas shit, that gas shit. That gas shit. Kind of fake, huh? Treating it like a stove, <laughs> nigga. I don't even feel like I'm queuing on. I'm not barbecuing unless it's the shit with the charcoal, nigga. Damn. Old school when you smoke yeah, that bitch. You gotta get that bitch ready. You gotta get ready. I'm a smoker. Yeah, <laughs> raised by OGs, not IG. You understand me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, the that's black one, one. That's the one you open up from the top. Why wow, I was going to look at this. You, smoking. Hold on, you gotta nigga, get out their way. Nigga. Yeah, <laughs> nigga, you spray some beer on them bitches, nigga. You can't even spray no drink on them little new cues, nigga. Same, man. <laughs> that shit gonna blow up in your face. Because <laughs> it's gas hell and shit. You can't pour no beer on no propane. Oh, what was... Oh that my was God. Bum. Hank Hill never did that. Mm. Yeah, this this whole area. I'm like, bruh, I was at the house. I enjoyed Shout out to all the motherfuckers that stayed at home for Memorial Day. If you wasn't out there getting no money, you understand me? Because mm-hmm. um, I enjoyed that, man. I think sometimes, um, you know, sometimes it's a good thing to watch people from afar. Because you start, you be feeling Especially like you right missing now, something. Just can't act right. Yeah. Man. You feel like you missing should, something, and yeah. then you really don't end up missing nothing. We should be getting out this energy soon. We are in, we were in retrograde for a minute, so it man, been fuck all up. that, nigga. For real, that <laughs> no. shit don't make white people less racist and shooting up shit. It don't, but because we are retrograde, it was bad. It was bad this time though. That it, shit did happen while we was in retrograde. It's a lot of it's a lot. Of, <laughs> <laughs> I'm, gonna was, I'm gonna kick you the fuck off. I'm gonna say technically, <laughs> technically, it did happen <laughs> while we was in. <laughs> Slavery <laughs> happened during retrograde. <laughs> Ooh, that the was moon amazing. came, threw white people brain off, and they oh were just like, God. let's go capture some niggas. It was during retrograde. Give me the lighter. Why is niggas <laughs> shooting up every place? No, nah, I'm not even saying niggas. Let me stop saying <laughs> niggas. Bro, graduations done people? got shot. The gra- yeah. I done seen uh, That's a good all kind of shit getting shot. Somebody just got shot at Doughboy Daughter School. Whoa. You lying. Oh, gosh. He was like, really... Where the dude got shot at, she was supposed to be right there, but a teacher asked her to... Now, that's a good question. I would probably post this in the community. Would you consider putting your child or children in uh, homeschooling because of the 
uproar and uprise with um, school shootings happening, especially in the U.S. Would you do that? To do something, and she was somewhere else. Ah, oh, hell. Yeah, she, no. she ain't. She ain't even go to school um, today or tomorrow. She, he like she Why done for the week. Yeah, they shooting shit up. They really shot somebody. What's wrong Five with these times. people? What y'all, why y'all think Conflict all these mass resolution is at an all time low? And what are these guns doing? Just sitting around randomly? They own people because they scared. God damn. Everybody's scared. Niggas be like, oh, so she gets shot up, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. People be like, oh, we got to give out the, you know, throw away the guns. Mass shootings don't make niggas get less guns. It make niggas get more guns. Because mm -hmm. that's Anytime niggas shit happens, it make you go get that's more ammunition fact. That's and a fact. more guns. Yeah. That's a fact. So now you got a niggas who's paranoid. Ain't never shot shit. You got to think about it. That's why we traumatized. We've yeah. been around mass shoes our whole life and yeah. didn't even know they was mass shoes. Man. Bruh, we nigga, were talking yeah. about that on the phone. Yeah, I don't, yeah. nigga, these niggas like getting straps. <laughs> 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 Bruh, I was like, if I would have known what classified as a mass shooting, yeah, they, cause they said any mass shooting since they've been around. Yeah. Not for real, Because they said if it's like, what? What, three, uh, three or more people, people get shot hit. at one time? It's, it's, it's a mass like shoot. That bus stop I was at when it got sprayed up. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, I grew up in mass shoes. Nigga, yeah. every function was a mass shooting down there. Nigga. Nah, for real. You they know how many really niggas that, way. you know how many parties got shot up and three niggas got hit? Nigga, that's, that's a mass easy. shooting. Yeah, that's easy. So it's like, shit, I see why they, the world just now getting traumatized. If you grew up in but the function But now it's like, era. it's just ridiculous. I mean, you know, it's ridiculous in a way. It's, but the it's, old it's people, really the kids, the, the random. The so we got so much access to information. So the shit we would find out uh -huh. today, we wouldn't find out 30 years ago. That's a fact. Because mm. I heard bro was buying, he bought all the pieces separate and put the gun together. So it don't have no... Uh, oh. No little, what's the shit on your strap? You got the little serial, serial number, number, all that. It don't have one of them. Uh, Cause if you if you put it together, and you have to be a certain age to purchase gun items or anything that would be harmful. Yeah, they didn't don't got one. Cause they can't. You know what I'm saying? Track oh. it all the shit. So and to I bet your you point. if I go on YouTube right now and look mm -hmm. up how to build an AR, you can they that. show you. It's a little white boy named right Chad. There. Yeah. <laughs> Greasy as fuck in his mama garage, building an AR and show you how to do it. So show to your me. point, a lot of people is learning how to do shit. You can do anything on there. Yeah, Put it in. damn. That's why it's like you ain't shit. And even if it ain't that, they got all these offsets, off off sites, Reddit and nigga. I heard it's a whole bunch of sites racist people use that ain't like you know. It's yeah. the IG of racism, nigga. Like and they'll give you a gun without a license. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta do it. Yeah, check. facts, they facts. Give you a gun without that. Facts. You know what I'm saying? They you tell you. Yeah. Yeah. They give you some dumb ass rules. If, you yeah. if you white, all you gotta do is act nice. <laughs> Hi, can I get a gun? <laughs> oh sure, Billy. <laughs> they ain't gonna. It's been a lot of break-ins in my community, and I just wanna <laughs> be an upstanding citizen. And take care of my people. Hmm. Let the crip say that. Okay. It's Look over. That. That shit crazy. Yeah. Happen, Everybody crazy. stay in y'all P's and Q's. You understand me? For real. Because it's crucial. It really is. I ain't seen a nigga fight since motherfucking. Man. Like when the last time you seen a fight? <laughs> I haven't seen him fight in a long time. I I'm saying in real life. Like, you didn't win. When? A couple years ago. Where? Where at? At the family room. Oh, uh, okay. Two females. And I seen a nigga get stomped out up there. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie That's one thing about LA Y'all still be fucking with fighting yeah, just, LA. With squab and all that shit They really fight Run a fade and all that shit Yeah, yeah. I mean, man, but, yeah. but uh <laughs> no, I, I broke up the female fight Cause Shorty had a wine opener in her hand mm. I was like You finna poke this girl eye out nigga. Mm, that that little twirly thing. Yeah. yeah That's a good weapon it is, Yeah though. I was like fight. Yeah. We ain't finna turn it <laughs> Yeah. I just seen the equalizer. That nigga Denzel's fucking shit up with that wine opener, nigga. When the last know. time you seen a fight, Precious? That's what I was really sitting there thinking. When have I seen a fight? Because I'm thinking. I don't remember the last time I seen a fight. It's been a minute for sure. Niggas on fight. And D, I think we was in a pandemic. It was too. Th so we missed a year. So I didn't ain't see a nigga fight in there since like 2018. For real. I seen a rumble <laughs> maybe like. Two years ago. What's the difference? Ooh. What's the difference between a rumble and a fight? It wasn't no fist. What's no, a rumble? rumble is like twenty people fighting. 
Well, oh, for oh, real? Shit. Yeah, it was in the middle of the street, nigga. And nobody started shooting? Nah. Damn, where was you at? And, and on the east side. Damn, y'all really be fighting out here. Yeah. Really? <laughs> they out here like warriors. Like, what the fuck? To what the last man standing? <laughs> what are y'all doing? That's hella funny. I remember I was at the homie house and I just heard some shit. I looked out the window. I was like, mm. God damn, it's hella people And they just going outside. at it. Going at damn. it. Damn. And they fought for like 10, 15 minutes. Nobody got shot. Wow. Yeah, it was a long ass fight. I'm like, you niggas is young. That's but they crazy. say the east side is the worst side, so they put, but probably wasn't nobody going to come nowhere. They probably right? was here. Yeah, that's probably some neighborhood shit or something like that. These mo- these young niggas got switches now. Yeah, they now. fought these so long, the police tripping. didn't even pull up. That's what I'm saying. Like, Nothing. Clearly, this is just... stop fighting. <laughs> People don't have fights for 10, 15 minutes. A lot of, yeah. You heard a little something. Them niggas should have got paid. Pay. They should have put that on pay-per-view. <laughs> I and can't fight for no fee. I can't. Boy, they like three, four houses deep off the main street. Uh... So, nigga, the police can see these niggas. Like, if you were to just... I to might fight a minute. You? I ain't gonna make it through a minute, my nigga. Oh, this gonna be side. over quick, fool. Oh, my mama. I'm not gonna play with nobody. I got one minute for it, <laughs> What, nigga. I look like a professional? <laughs> 10 to 15 minutes? <laughs> Fuck. Hell no, nah, never, fool. We finna go. <laughs> Give me that goddamn wine over there. <laughs> I don't plan on fighting for the rest <laughs> of my life. What? No, I can't. I don't wanna no, get fool. no Tomorrow fight. Fighting, That's fool. over, bro. I'm finna be 30 on these niggas. I just turned 28. What I look like fighting about? I don't want to fight nobody. I'm retired. Well, that's why niggas is getting shot more. Niggas is 15 <laughs> talking about what I look like fighting. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, these are your fighting years. <laughs> now you want to be mad. <laughs> Facts. These what young niggas, about? niggas 13, bro. I'm too old you know to be fighting. Nigga. <laughs> nigga, I was raised by OGs. Nigga, now I don't fight. I'm strapped quick. Like, no. Because our OGs <laughs> fought. Like, our pops and our OGs, they was in that. When they was growing up, they fought and shit. You know what I'm saying? Niggas whipped out straps when it was time to really kill a nigga on some gangster. You know, some OG yeah. shit. Feel me? But nowadays, like, these kids' OGs ain't really like our OGs. Like, they, they OGs, OGs is like 40. Nigga, they OGs is like 38 and 40. Like, niggas that's 38 and 40, nigga, them niggas grew up in the hyphy movement. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, Max Rue would have been like 40 right now. Feel me? So it's like, nigga, they was raised on some different shit. These niggas is, these young niggas mobbing, nigga. These little pill babies, nigga, just. Man. Pulling out switches, nigga. Nigga, just. Hold on, bro. Watch out, watch out, watch out. These little niggas crazy, bro. That's another thing, the artillery up. Yeah. They got all kind of switches and shit, yeah. ghost guns and yeah. niggas building guns. Like it's just, it's, we man, really grew up like Friday. You win some, you lose some. <laughs> but you live. Fight another but day. You to fight another like you really had to fight Debo. Really though. Now it's like nigga. Now pops is saying nigga pop that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Pop that nigga. If Bob's told him to pop him, if they walk up, pop him. <laughs> if Friday was made the modern day air, nigga, that whole sh- everybody getting shot. Nigga long, smoky. Man. Nigga, everybody switches Stanley on the whole block. <laughs> Stanley, he done got shot in the house, nigga. Look, he's there. Oh, they no, done no. shot that nigga for walking on the grass. Stop walking on my grass. Hold on, who you talking to? <laughs> well, fuck your grass, nigga. <laughs> That's ridiculous, fool. We yeah, n- niggas be shooting, bro. That shit crucial. But you know, it's crazy. Niggas be living too. Yeah. I be seeing uh, it's this little meme or like TikTok thing. Is uh, I'm still alive. I'm still alive. <laughs> niggas showing their hula hoops and shit. Like, I'm still alive. No, like, I bro. made it. Oh, I'm still alive. Like, like no, them niggas gonna spin the block again. Nigga, let them see. Oh, it. mama saying you celebrate because you made it. <laughs> Damn, my nigga, lay low. Man. Niggas out here like fucking glow. <laughs> You be tripping, fool. That's funny. <laughs> I'm still. That's what your nigga do. Ah, that's what took me out, nigga. Still. Hey, dancing. They got this the dancing shit. What's up with this booty short shit? Oh, that's on the TikTok. The hoochie daddy shorts. Then um, it's, I think Clint started this shit. Clint, oh really? Coley. Yeah. Swear, shut up, my nigga Clint, man. Clint. Coley, man, I like that nigga. Got wearing them old school short shorts. You know what I'm saying? The old Niggas school basketball really shorts. So. Is that like a big thing right now? Because I just see it on it's my It's pretty time. much going up. I see it a lot online. Niggas is parent preparing to show their thighs or something. Yeah, y'all look like out here with the these man, shorts. Man. Hoochie daddy shorts. Yeah. We can't be doing They're going everything the women doing. I mean, you know. <laughs> you might look nice in them. 
See, that's what they say. It is, but that's in style, though. I get it. <laughs> I, I'm not knocking it you, being you, above you your look. knees. Like, your shit past your knees. You fake ancient right now. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you still like that. <laughs> <laughs> you damn near on but, um, You damn near. Nigga, what you taking out the trash or something? <laughs> <laughs> you know, nigga throwing some weak ass shorts when he got some pussy. You got to take it off. You got to do something real fast. Hold on, let me throw these on. Man. Now I be walking in the lobby looking hella weak. I thought I mad. <laughs> You make it home safe. They got some and one shorts. Like, <laughs> and one shorts, nigga. Nah, I'm sure. You know? <laughs> I feel uh-huh. so. I ain't knocking the style. It's just these terminologies, these terms, these hoochie, daddy. hoochie daddies. They trying to make niggas the new bitches. That's they what been I'm doing saying. it for a while now. Yeah. That's why they always insert. They started no, with the girl they, purses and. Yep. Niggas is zesty. And they insert the gay scenes that we don't need a lot of times and mm-hmm. stuff randomly. You know what I'm saying? A lot more than the regular people. I'm not saying not, not saying they're not regular. I'm saying. <laughs> I know what you're saying. Like, yeah, it's just, yeah, it's Pride Month. I was just watching to see what <laughs> Not in the main way. I got, I got gay friends. <laughs> That's what motherfuckers do when they try to, uh, try to make I got nigga friends. Yeah. <laughs> I know some niggas. I just say I love everybody. Everybody know I, I love everybody. Like, <laughs> no, for real. You know what I'm saying? They be like, wait. What is it? They be like, smooth. What? Can you teach me how to duck? Uh, uh, yeah. Go. Uh, 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 look. Hey. All I need hey. is to beat the super bummer. Hey. Hey. You, hey. Hey. Back it up and up. Hey. hey. Hey, I want mama. That shit go. Shout out Cali Swift. That was, that was the last dance Rest I was peace, fucking babe, with. Yeah. Oh, bro, they did? Like, two of them niggas died. Damn. One got killed, and I think the other one had like a heart Who attack. killed the Dougie niggas? Niggas just killing anybody yeah. now. Anybody, this shit ridiculous, bro. Yeah, nigga, you killing niggas that did the Dougie? You gonna and, kill and you know why, too. He probably was hitting that shit, and that nigga bitch chose up, and he got hot. It, oh, that's it's all... Good. The jails and the cemeteries is full... Of niggas that died over a bitch. Oh my mama. Facts. Wow. Yes. I ain't I ain't never had a problem on some just street shit. It's always, always over. It's always over a nigga hating on me because you, you, you understand me? Huh? <laughs> yeah, man. <dang. laughs> you know what the f- going on? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. It's always. Oh my mama, bitch. Damn. You understand me? Nigga, yeah. don't yeah. check me. Check your perspective. You understand me? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Change your mentality, man. It always be about some money or uh, or female, but it really be about some female. Because I never had no problem about some money. Man. It, no, like, motherfuckers respect that. It just be... Niggas be mad, fool. Niggas People be can't mad. take it. That's crazy. Women tight. really got clout, Because you bro. can be late on some money. Like, bro, I'm going to throw a tax on there, bro. I got you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Niggas ain't playing enough. with a nigga bitch that he loves, yeah. but act like he don't. Niggas ain't playing enough to be like, oh, you took my bitch? Oh, I'm going to take your bitch now. Niggas be like, you took my bitch? <laughs> but I ain't never been to taking niggas bitches. But you don't know that you took the bitch sometimes. And that be the problem. Oh. You pulled and up see, on that's so the plot twist right there. That's the plot. That's why yeah. you really. We don't know what the fuck. That's why niggas take their time with the chick. Because I don't know what you got. You better cut all ties while you fucking with me. <laughs> better shut all that shit down. Got That's why I fuck with random females is a buzz. Because yeah. women, they be having hella little shit going on. They'll tell you nothing. Shit. It's a nigga looking through your window right now. You got me inside this motherfucker. <laughs> it be all type of shit. It ain't. Yeah, it don't, yeah, it don't be like that. I was talking on the phone with a chick. And she was FaceTiming another nigga one time. Wow. I heard the nigga voice. I said... Yeah. Is you on the phone with another nigga? <laughs> <laughs> this nigga just listening to our conversation? I hung up. <laughs> oh, I'm a savage. One of the, sm- uh, one of the most... Sa- these new bitches are savages. Nah, yeah, these bitches bad. You got, you got me on a day. day. I pulled up on a female, <laughs> and the bitch had another nigga pull up like some other niggas pull up. It was basically like me and my niggas, and then she had... Some other niggas pull up and she was trying to make us be cool. But I seen the niggas walk up and I'm with my niggas. I'm like, they don't even know that these niggas, like these niggas didn't even know we was looking at them. So I'm like, damn, bro, this, this could have been us. And this how niggas be getting killed. Mm-hmm. Feel me? Because we, why, we walking, imagine if we, like, imagine if we was like some hating ass niggas and be mm-hmm. like, bro, they finna go fuck with the same bitch we fuck with. We get mad. And then you feel it could me? Just be something out yeah, of nothing. Yeah, I'm like, out of nothing. It, just set up I'm like, quick. see, I'm like, bruh, see, 
that's why niggas be getting shot. Because the females be getting niggas shot on accident. Because I think females can be cool with other females. Like, females can be cool with other random females. So, if a girl not ganged up, she'll put you in a bad situation, like, thinking, like, no, we all cool, we chill. We are, we nah, not I don't chill cool. with random niggas. Yeah, yeah, Bitch, yeah. let me know what, what, if it ain't me and my niggas, bitch, it's this nigga really love you. You see what I'm saying? Mm. And I'm just here. I'm here trying to fuck. And this He's nigga trying to slut you out. <laughs> <laughs> he might be wanting to drink, vibe, talk to you about some intimate shit, and I'm gonna be here. having deep conversations. We don't do that. Feel me? <laughs> you this nigga's therapist. <laughs> I ain't your therapist. This nigga might be ready to do some nasty hands. shit than what I'm willing to do. I'm finna hit from the back, get sucked. This nigga ready to eat ass. Make I'm not finna be competition. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm not, not competing. <laughs> <laughs> so if you got some other niggas that want to pull up, let them niggas pull up. I'm not pulling up where other niggas need to be. Mm-hmm. You understand me? I love everybody. Nah, you're right. Just... Have you ever done some shit like that, Precious? Stand a nigga up. No, I just had niggas in. <laughs> hey, so you owe some whole shit? Nah, I always say niggas up like that. No, like nah. had a nigga drop you off to your other nigga. Or this mm-hmm. I, I ain't have a nigga drop me off, but I done some savage shit. Like, go get money from this nigga and then go get it. <laughs> 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 man. Just, That's like, no, she really done this shit. shit. <laughs> she got to tell the story. <laughs> What did you do, Precious? <laughs> you, you know, I wouldn't got money from that nigga. I just bust a blue plate, got some money in there. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> you gotta be black, dude. So you had a nigga, and he was with you, and you went to go pick up some money from another nigga? <laughs> no, no, no. I, I was by my, I just, I, no. She was, was living. Yeah. This nigga was kicking money. Uh-huh. She, he was kicking time. Mm-hmm. She took both. Women do be having niggas close to each other for <laughs> sure. It could be like a lot of females be having dudes around like bro ain't hit yet, but he didn't probably cast out on some boosty shit. And then it's the nigga that hit there and this my friend and this my friend. And then niggas All really these friends. I don't believe the friendship. Cause I know who I am <laughs> in this friendship. <laughs> You're lying like to him shit. about us being friends. <laughs> You're lying. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you lying to me about? But if the people you fuck with not in the same circle, you won't be doing Everyone who you call friend is not a friend. So please use that word carefully. Everyone is not a friend, okay? Right? You know what I'm saying? Dang a lot of women like, I don't know. I think women it's just be a, risking it for that feeling. Facts. Yeah, like they something about seeing birthday. all their niggas in the same room turn them on. <laughs> Y'all too. With bitches, you know what I'm saying? But no. that is a pretty player. If you can keep it player mm-hmm. and you know and it's at least, you know what I'm saying, two in the possible that you might in this room, you pretty player to me. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit, mm-hmm. everybody chilling. It depends you know what on saying? what the situation is with them. Okay, right, true. Yeah. But I'm saying, if you ain't no just, I don't know. I ain't never done it like on some shit like, I fuck with a girl and it's other bitches. I'm not, I got to keep that isolated. But also... <laughs> Just random bitches. I put I put a busload of hoes in one. Bitch. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> All you bitches gang out with me. I don't give a fuck because I don't I don't fuck with none of y'all. Right. So that's easy. Yeah. Because nobody can get mad at each other because all y'all the same. I think it's I think people be out of pocket when they be putting they ones in the mix of shit that's not they ones. It's like right. you got me fucked up now, bitch. Because yeah. you got me next to some niggas. You know right. I'm way more valuable than you right. than me. Right. That's so, real. You know, okay. I think as a man, I think you out of pocket when you do that, though. I think. She ain't going to do that to you if she fuck with you, you know? You don't think so? I don't think so. I think, you know what I'm saying? I think you can know somebody randomly the way we can know random people. You know what I'm saying? But you just happen to be real. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just like you can know. <laughs> you can. You can know. Y'all be sneaking and geeking. Women sneaky, bro. No, I'm just it saying. It be the gay nigga. Re- you be like, what? That nigga been fucking since he was. <laughs> went random on the block. Nigga just been hitting since he was 11, nigga. Shut the fuck up. Bro, that's up. hella funny. But he's gay, though. I'm just he saying, when I'm around. it's Not different from knowing people and then just really being cool with them. You know what I'm saying? Facts. So it's like, we've been out here long enough, you're going to know people. It's three levels you know to saying? relationships with women. <laughs> fuck you, Danny. <laughs> what's, fuck what's your, what's, what's your what levels? Like, you know, it's like, all right, I just fucked this nigga. This is my little nigga that got some cheese. I fuck him and all the shit. Every female got that. Then you got the nigga that you like, oh, he got some potential. I might fuck with him. And then he, women got that. This my nigga. It's over. That's what I think. Mm. 
How many how many situationships women have? I think it's about three. I mean, if you're putting it in threes, then you made it sound good. Like, <laughs> yeah, because you know what shit's serious and what ain't, you know? Mm-hmm. Right. You don't walk into no shit blind. Man, you nigga don't want to be dry out here. Man, you got to have something, huh? Yeah. On my mama, huh? <laughs> and women do too, mama. huh? Women ain't going to go 100% dry. No. Cause that's how their mama got hurt. That's how their auntie got hurt. That's why Mary J. Blige was writing all them songs. Yeah. Man, you know how to feel that pain. Facts. They done enough crime. I'm F R E E. Fuck nigga free. Mamas, huh? Nah, for real. What what it take for you to give up all your niggas? Huh? To give them all up? Huh? 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 Just like a nigga. <laughs> oh, mama. Um, what would it take for? I'm not even gonna say you. Just women in general. What you think would make women be like? All right, I'm finna stop fuck with all these niggas and just fuck fuck with one nigga. I'm just saying. I would. I would definitely have to be, just be super secure. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I would have to feel super secure. He would really have to be like. You know what I'm saying? You really ain't got to do nothing, but I'm because I'm investing in you. I want you to win. You know what I'm saying? So he gonna do all this shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he gonna basically be like, goddamn amazing. You know what I'm saying? The man of my fucking <laughs> shit. And he gonna then, let me be open to be me, but he ain't gonna be no nigga that's in the mix ass nigga. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. loyal as fuck behind my back. You know what I'm saying? That'll make me. You not into niggas <laughs> that's like uh I don't know where in the do. in the way. Because mm-hmm. I, I don't think... like an in the way ass nigga. Um, I'm ready for my close up ass nigga, and you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm not into women that's in the limelight. Like, I'm not into that. Yeah, I think when you lot. like in the entertainment business, like yeah. I can't fuck with no bitch that's trying to make something about her. Bitch, Man. it's about me to get this money. Right, and they be I, sneaking. I, I, I had women like it be acting cool, like they cool, and then, and next then time. what you think about being like a YouTube couple or? Oh my mama! So oh, what? <laughs> they yeah. for sure try oh, to pull that. Boy, what? I done messed with so many women that, you, you know, with their about, time, they be like, yeah, I'm trying to start up this. Bitch, what you telling me? <laughs> 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 nah, for it real, always got something to do with like clout. Mm-hmm. You know, I just don't got the fan base to... Ah, uh, shit. Uh, that's crazy. You got to build it up that's for crazy, up. y'all. That's crazy. <laughs> now, nah, you got to pay attention to that because people yeah. be having motives like a motherfucker now. Bitch be trying to get on that YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> I heard such and such made da 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 da. Don't nobody want us to go see us grocery shop. <laughs> I think it's entertaining. That's what we go real. through, huh? Mm-hmm. Like, <clears throat> I for sure, I for sure go through that a lot. Just you know, just also, you know, oh, you was acting like this at your show, or mm-hmm. why I couldn't go. The show's not about us. It's about me. <laughs> It's nothing. I'm the star. <laughs> yeah. You can't. This is my movie. <laughs> and really, I be removing myself out of the situation. I'm like, you see all the people out there? Mm-hmm. Worked all week. <laughs> left their kids. Nigga had to go get a babysitter. Don't do this right now. This day, this day one night mm-hmm. that they might. What, what if something happened? Mm-hmm. And you fucked the night off for these people. Yeah. See it me. How would you feel? Yeah. yeah. Now, you don't it. fuck with the limelight, bitches? You don't like it? Well, but I just... you know what? It's hard, though, when you think about it, because then we want somebody to fuck with us that ain't like that, but then they got to look at your shit, go up, all uh, the comments. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, they got to be a pretty You don't. My best person relationships is when girls don't follow me. Right. For real? Yeah. But then I don't really be posting shit like this is right. back in one, the day shit when I, I was be, younger. I be wanting women to see, my, see me succeed. You know what I'm talking about? Feel free to see the best of me. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> Giving you the if best you can't me, take it, hmm. you can't fuck with it. Cause it's only worse in real life. Oh, man. Real life hmm. real life success hit different than <laughs> online. So if you can't take my online hmm. comments, that don't even, that ain't <clears throat> that, I love that. That's cool. But real life be hitting different. Especially when you take a shorty out and you really see something that's giving you some rhythm that you could not, you'd be like, damn, if I wasn't with shorty. <laughs> <laughs> we be feeling the same way, like, God damn. For real. If you wasn't with that nigga. This nigga. <laughs> <laughs> you be the buff ass well, nigga good. with the locks. <laughs> buff <laughs> ass <laughs> nigga. <laughs> you wanna go to my island? <laughs> Face ass. Nah, but we That's can't. hella funny. Yeah, nah, the entertainment shit, that's that shit it takes, it's hard for so, your yeah. partner to understand that. Yeah. 
It but really would be. That's why a lot of the uh, people that's in entertainment don't have people. Ultimately, end up mm-hmm. dating somebody in entertainment because they like almost the only person that understand it, huh? Well, if I got to do it, yeah, niggas ain't had no choice. If to... honestly, that is so sad. Don't and uh, the person that I that came to my mind was Michael B. Jordan and Laurie Harvey. I really hope that both of those people find whatever they're looking for and I wish them both the best because you know being at a certain point in your life sometimes you wouldn't really understand what you want until it's really too late so I do hope that whatever party decided to leave I hope that they did it for their best interest fuck it but that's bunk my bitch in entertainment. I'm why can't the love of my life be a librarian? Yeah, bitch, why you can't be under? <laughs> why you just can't? Why yeah, we can't get away from this shit? Because then, yeah. Say if she in entertainment, I'm doing entertainment, then it's... Now I'm talking about your movie. You too. I'm talking about my movie. You got a show, I got a show. Then we off. We thinking about shows and shit. Now we doing shows together. That might not be as bad, though. Right, huh? that's beautiful. That's, that's what building the empire. Say, boy. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Actually, this but sounds... if it works, it works. If it's terrible, oh yeah, and it fell apart. You, it's just new. Now you it. arguing on the road, and shit. man. You play, now you like Ike and Tina trying yeah, to be you Beyonce and Jay Z. <laughs> Y'all tripping and shit. You know how hard it is to be Jay Z and Beyonce. That yeah. shit is hard, and they, they now, get... and you know everybody's been trying to pull it off, nigga. <laughs> it's been <For> time. <laughs> Nobody really said, achieved Everybody it. trying to pull it out. They are. Everybody said, everybody goes to be Jay-Z and Beyonce. Nigga, we going to like Or the Jay-Z Will and Jada aspect back in the day. Oh, back yeah, they the blew day. that. Mm-hmm. They blew that. You see how stressed that nigga is from fucking with the little entertainment bitch. Bitch, everything ain't about you. I'm Will. He cracked the joke on me. Fuck is you mad for? Well, nah, he cracked her. He, j- he cracked yeah. it on her. All right, he And he Will, ass. but she's Jada. Yes. <laughs> Shit. Yes, yeah. and Jada got your ass. You just got your ass roasted. I'd have been laughing. <laughs> <laughs> it was because that last, the other Oscars, when he, he said, he, was, uh, he said a lot of reckless shit. And he uh, said, "You don't even do nothing that gets nominated for Oscars. What you, are you doing here?" You he think just, Pac and Jada would have worked? No. Yeah, she'd have fucked around told he, on that nigga. Or something. Yeah, he like hoes. He like bitches, nigga. And she wasn't with that. We don't know that. She might have helped him. She like, looked a little nasty to me. Yeah, like, but like, no, nah, she way. wasn't. At the end of the day, all these I like they want to hold one nigga, have that one nigga be the everything, and, and it just don't work like that. Niggas always got at least um, <laughs> one to <or> two. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> That's why at some point we have to, because everybody swear they don't go for that shit. But at some point we was going for that shit until you found out. You know what I'm saying? Or let you find out again. No, explain going. for the people you at home. Just... <laughs> she explain. <laughs> she, I, I want to give more detail. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, you have to realize and, you know, understand uh, what you go going to do as, as a person and not be so, expecting so much out of people. You know what I'm saying? Mm. When we expect a lot, you know what I'm saying? Man. It fuck you up. And Tell that's them in about anything. the expectations. That's, it's in that's anything. You, you know what I'm saying? Time. Like, you, you have them high expectations, you get let the fuck down. You so. think these modern day women nowadays got to accept that niggas is going to fuck with other women? No, I'm not saying just accept it, but at least be open to, like, having conversations. You know what I'm saying? Where it could be. I always... My mind always went on basketball players and how if they do have a wife or someone that they're close with, I know them being on the road half the time. I know deep down they have other people that they are entertaining on the road, but I always wonder do the wife or girlfriend know about the person? I always, my mind always go on that be a, a equal relationship you know what i'm saying uh-huh. like if you know that's what you do you know what i'm saying uh-huh. or you know like at least you got one then what did you still want me to have nothing or i could at least have one too if yeah. i'm protected yeah or what let's make a deal <laughs> i don't know because do we like each other enough to even do that or what are we doing because you know yeah we have conversations like that you can go ahead and just be with that nigga <laughs> 
Or should I be protected with these niggas? Should I wear a crown? Yeah, yeah, bitch. Follow your instinct. Go ahead. Go ahead. It's all anyway. I don't want. We gotta have rules. You see how the uh, how the Michael Blackson and his girl. You know what I'm saying? That nigga shit. paying for that shit. That ain't no. But she don't. Shit. She can't fuck with nobody else. But I'm saying, like, if you was really. You know what I'm saying? It's different when you got a relationship and an understanding with a female versus mm -hmm. you pay a fee and, you know, when you pay a fee, you can make the rules. Mm -hmm. You can pay a bitch and you can pay some women enough. Not all women, but there's some women out there. If you, if they, you can financially take care of them, then they'll, let, they'll let you do whatever, whatever you want to do. do. And that ain't no, that's not no player shit. That's just... That's just convenient. That just works for your lifestyle. That's what you choose to do. But mm -hmm. I don't like when people play it like, oh, nigga, my girl, like, nigga, no. You tell the backstory, too. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Because mm -hmm. you're going to have other niggas losing their bitches. Because <laughs> everybody can't afford to do what you do. Exactly. And that shit just crazy. But it's, it works. It works for everybody. Tell, tell, tell them about the apartment you, you paid for. Uh huh. <laughs> All these niggas out here buying a bitch apartment somewhere. But shit, <laughs> if if you can afford it. Is it tricking if you got it? It ain't tricking if you got it, right? Right, like if Drake get a chicken apartment, is it tricking? Nah. I mean, it can't be. That's nah. nothing to him. Nah, that ain't, right? that ain't no cheese for him. He can get him. it and pay it up. For the, that ain't no cheese for him. That ain't nothing. But. Why is you fuck with a bitch that ain't got no apartment? <laughs> if I'm Drake. What if he just upgrade nah, you need a chick with a, like, uh, I need you I need you with a chauffeur. <laughs> said, I need you in the building with a chauffeur. If I'm Drake, I'm not fucking no bitch that ain't got their spot. Like, yeah. yeah, where are you at? If it's I got hard, though. It's, you would make an exception or two. You see the baddest, rawest thing you've never seen in your life? She just happened to be going through a hard time right now. Oh, man. My freakness, not my weakness. I think something no, wrong And that's me. good. No, I think really something really wrong with me. I really don't get don't turned on by that 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 like begging skin. broke shit and mm -hmm. all that shit. Oh, I don't that voice when bitches start doing it. Why I honey? just don't. Mm -hmm. That shit turn me off. Yeah, I like bitches that like you know like matter of fact. Like, I don't know. I like <laughs> strong women. I don't know. I might be it might be a phase that it, I've been going through for the past. Uh, 10 years but shit <laughs> nigga, all life, young, nigga. Nigga. My whole life I ain't never been attracted like to Bum ass bitches yeah. You know I done fucked with some bum bitches I'm not finna act like I'm just this all star nigga And I right. ain't never did no you bunk shit with no bunk bitches But I'm saying I was in a dark place in my life <laughs> <laughs> I made some exceptions <laughs> I was ass and they was ass And we was ass together but if I'm doing good, I'm not fucking with no bitches that's doing bad. Right, right. When I was doing bad, I'm fucking with bitches that's on my level. Right. Feel me? Right. Now, I can't get mad at them for not having no car because I ain't got no car. Bitch, right. we, let's walk together. I hit your shit once we walk home. Right. I done walk home with bitches and we fuck. That was the level I was on. And, I, and I'm not talking about financially. I'm just talking about mentally. Right. Like, I done caught myself looking at a bad bitch walking. And I snap out like, this bitch walking. <laughs> Cause that's how they do us. Nah, for they, real. That's how women treat men. At the end of the day, bro, I'm a nice looking man. I'm aware that women think I'm attractive. I'd have been not having no money, and some bitches have passed. Not saying they not attracted to me or they wouldn't fuck with me if yeah, I'm in a certain no position. But, but if I'm walking, yeah, they like it's not even a yeah. You feel me? It's like oh, he cute, but damn, he walking. I'ma still knock some bitches, but the ones. Gonna be like, they gonna get in the car with the ugly nigga that's driving. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what I'm saying they is they like to control the heat. You feel me? That, that dual, <laughs> your side get cold, her side get hot, nigga. Fellas, I don't give a fuck. I'm how nice, saying. like how nice you lose you your bitch to that dual. You heat. gotta have something going on. Everybody gotta have their shit too. Everybody got their standards. You can't just. Shit, motherfucker be done help the motherfucker. Niggas always got a story about how yeah. man, I was helping this motherfucker when they did this and they yeah. was holding my money in the video when it was this. <laughs> yeah. Niggas always got something to say, but niggas say That's why niggas don't like women meeting new niggas because a nigga go show you some shit I can't show you and mm -hmm. now you can't come you can't come back. So you exactly. ain't never wrong for having your shit. Like you gotta at least meet me here. Like if I got if I got <laughs> So well, fellas, what y'all niggas need to stop doing is stop getting distracted by these cute ass bitches that's walking and shit. Mm. Now it's different if she can't get in the club and she raw. She come walk in with me, it's yeah. good. Player shit. But bitch, you don't gotta ride to the club. Like you literally walk into that like, bitch. Or, you know? or just whatever, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I'm low on funds right now, but I want to pull up to on you tonight. But hit, hit. I just, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't want to pull up because I don't know, you know. 
I don't want you to pull up there. I'm cool. That's turning me off. Bitch, if you broke, don't say you broke. You better. You <laughs> if better you broke, just say You better it. act like you forgot some money or something, <laughs> bitch, with you and me. And if you forgot your cheese, it's the last time us kicking it. Wow. Mm, I don't like that shit. I like to get treated equal. I like a woman. I like to. I don't like nothing that don't like me. Nah, I feel you. As, and it take a minute to get to that for a lot yeah. of niggas. These <laughs> niggas is insecure and ugly. So when they get some money, they they all wanna, they want is the bad light skin bitch that they that they couldn't talk to back in the day. Why would you want to be with somebody that wouldn't want to really be with you? Hmm. You know how down and out you. Ooh, I touched the stone right now. Ooh, he is right. He is correct. You have to be in a. You got to be in a dark place to really pay for a bitch that don't like you. Message. <laughs> I love everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Niggas out here about to cut the podcast off like yeah. this nigga. Fuck with my self esteem now. No, nah, I'm trying to up your self esteem. <laughs> no, for real. Yes, there, it's a lot of women that's out here that's nice looking that's getting some money. You don't gotta fuck with these broke ass bitches. Nah, for real. Get you an estimation. Look at precious. Shit. She mean, look wait. good. She got her shit together. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. She said, wait a minute. And no. I'm the example. <laughs> Oh no no I'm just not, no keep me under the radar I ain't doing much. Precious to take you on a day. <laughs> See I'm no, trying to help y'all uh, niggas. Oh my gosh. Buy a ticket, support her, and then say something in the ear. She might. Man. Shit. Look, I ain't, I ain't taking you on no date. Thinking about it. Mm-hmm. You gotta feed me. That's the minimum. Hey. Oh, we got to eat. Shit. What you like? Stay good. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. But the people for the people, not for me. For the people, <laughs> <laughs> for the do, people do, at home. I do, I do like that and, and shit. Now that's and some oxtails and shit. That's something mm-hmm. I like. To I got do. some oxtails. We can go to eat. Right? We can go like get some meat. But bitch, we going to eat what I want to eat. Don't tell me what we eating. We are, Bam. You see what I'm saying? That's what you gonna do? Yeah, yeah. I don't. When so I if she. So this is if she asks you out to eat. If she asks me out to eat, mm-hmm. she paying and she telling me where she want where she taking me. Okay. And if it's somewhere I like, then I'll go. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go <over> here. <laughs> you know what? If it's something I like, I'll consider it. But you, you know? Mm-hmm. But if it's somewhere if I wanna take her out. Oh, we're gonna go where you wanna go. I'm going somewhere okay, I wanna go. Okay, I get it. And that. then I'm gonna see if she wanna go. Cause I wanna take nowhere, take a female where she don't wanna go. Right, yeah. going to I'm gonna tell her we going. I'm gonna run it by you, yeah. but I really wanna go here. I right. wanna go here, right. you feel me? Yeah. And I'm finna come grab you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm picking you up the whole shit. Pick you up and I'm paying for the shit. Cause I wanna go here and I want you to go with me. Yeah. But bitch, you wanna go somewhere? Well, let's have, let's make it happen. <laughs> oh make it happen, sister. I love everybody. Man, do y'all know what y'all want though? Do y'all want a relationship right now, or y'all chilling? Do you really know? Because yep, you got to know want what you want to manifest. You know, to really get what you want, you got to really know. So it can't be like, oh, I kind of want to do this, and mm-hmm. I kind of want to. You can't have one foot in. The, you know what I'm saying? You got to mm-hmm. be like, okay, I think I would live this type of. No, life. sometimes I close my eyes and mold my perfect thing. You do my perfect yo. Good, you good. Feel me like mm-hmm. I want a relationship. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, for real. Like, I, I, I want somebody that's right. for me. Mm-hmm. I just don't want to be in a relationship and then fuck up what I got going on. I would love to be in a relationship that just helped me flourish my shit. Right. It's Not like, in no selfish way, but, no, but I want to flourish along everybody. with what you're doing. Because yeah. when I flourish, we flourish. We flourishing yeah. together. But that's yeah. why she'll come in and help y'all flourish. You but know? a lot of women now, they scared to help a nigga flourish. Because they think they going to leave him for the next bitch. And when he get bitch. on, he leave your ass for a white, white girl. girl. Exactly. And that's we watched it happen. Shit. So I don't know, but now nah, you gotta, you gotta. <laughs> Sadly, that it happened though. It happened many times before. You gotta put yourself out there, you know. I done heard girls be like, "I made that nigga resume cover, uh, got that nigga his first interview Damn. suit." That's why I'm be and doing all that shit. As soon as he got, Damn, for real, <laughs> niggas can have a lot for it. Like, like nigga, nigga can have everything. I'm like, I cook a nigga one meal. Like, yeah, you can go get that nigga. Oh mama, I don't be tripping for us. That's what I'm like. Well. You gotta know what you, cause nigga. But I, I would want. I got my own life too. Like I gotta do shit. I would want. I would. I would, I would, I would want a female to do, uh, like more for me, and I ain't doing nothing for her though. Yeah. Like I would if I would want to upgrade whatever she got going on. Too, exactly. Though. That's why I should be one That'll of the youngins. That'll make me feel good, like nigga. You know. It gotta be like I'd have guided you. I'd have gave you some good game, and now you now yeah. look at us. You in a we different direction. Yeah, yeah, we are you know force, now we Jay Z Beyonce. Take it to the moon. Take it to the stars. 
I done gave you a different perspective. Now you and your sister, y'all better. Y'all relationship She used to fight with her moms. I set her both down. Now she tight with her moms. We talking. We talking about some boy. Y'all done got me high, man. I'm over here rapping Rick Ross blind. Look at ass. I'm like, you know me, you know that shit. Yeah, that's that shit. Oh shit. Uh, is that who? that here I am? Yeah. Yep. Here I'm on my... I am. I got up on the top of the second like to the moment. Hey. She can be my lady, she can be my love. I'm slapping at this summer. <laughs> right. I got to move on. That's a blast. Mm. Oh, mama. Yeah. Shit. That was the last uh, Nelly verse that I was like, yeah, I needed that. His verse was ass on that song. It was, but it that was like. That nigga said, uh, <laughs> what that nigga Nelly <laughs> say? I fuck it with Nelly. It was, but it was like. One minute, one minute. That nigga Where said, was Nelly you, you come time. to. I even did it. Yeah. Yeah. He <laughs> Actions took place at my place. Like, now, my now her place, place my place. place. Yeah. Now, that that shit was ass. That shit was hard at the time. We remember it, though. We remember it. At the time, that shit was hard, bro. No, for real. It's so a lot of shit that be ass. Who else was on there who was like, No, what'd he say? That nigga, that Brad nigga versus ass, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, man, I'm a Nelly fan, man. Shut I up. fuck with Nelly. Oh, Nelly that nigga. Fuck him to Nelly Bill. Uh. But when you talking about Nelly and his crew, you talking about that verse. I think it was ass he was like, yeah, I, you can call him and him tell him I could did it or whatever the oh, fuck yeah. he said. That um, shit was weak. <laughs> that was good. No, it was a good one. Big ups to Nelly, well, man. What was the verse this if it was good? What I he forgot. said he did it. I just, <laughs> I, I, I be writing. <laughs> You Cause niggas talk shit about Ja Rule and Nelly like they had the streets lit, nigga. Nelly that nigga. Nah, he yeah. was that nigga Nelly with not the even. Air the... oh, yeah. Man. Give me two per. We know, see y'all, see. Two per. <laughs> so I get the stuff out of my air phone. <laughs> see, that was that shit that went up. Put a comment. What did Nelly? Now that, that song put Air Force One on the map, in my opinion. He say in the verse of Rick Ross shit. <laughs> you ain't gotta Shut put up. it in the comment, nigga. I'm finna go watch the video. I know. I was trying to look it up. What do you say in the see. front in the beginning? Let me see. All I remember is took place at my place, not my place. Oh my god, it's her place and something place. Let me see. Ricky Ross. It's, let me see. Excuse me, woman. Come on. I'm finna sing. Y'all. That's so hella funny. That nigga ass. Uh, no, Nelly not ass. Nelly that nigga. I fuck with we Nelly. Still blew weed together. Cheated on the but we still gonna be together. With That's Rick Ross. Was, I know I was going. He to was it. going. I was getting there. He was rolling there. He was going. Yeah. Cheated on the but we still gonna be <laughs> <lead> together. <laughs> Niggas love that line. <laughs> Bitches do too though. Well right. Period. <laughs> Period. <laughs> Period. Hell no. Nah. My nigga ain't this. shit. I ain't shit. I'm gonna stick beside him. <laughs> shit, and I'm gonna stick beside him. <laughs> no, let me stop. I heard Suki say that shit. Suki on her. She's like, my nigga ain't shit, and I ain't shit. <laughs> Made <laughs> for each other. Oh, I was like, go ahead. Oh my god. Trina don't get enough uh, credit, nigga. Trina the goat, man. She is the goat. She go. I got an ass bitch. so big Ooh. like the Ooh, sun. Man. I've been wondering, man, what? Trina, go. Man, she told her, thick and fine out that corner in that cabbage. Okay, I'm like, she go. Oh, my mama. Trina was the first bad bitch. <laughs> Fuck all these new bitches. Oh, my mama. I be in the place that I be in. Who the fuck is that I be in? Put my boss in the bed. You know now, ho. She's good. Uh-uh. Am I nigga trick daddy? You like me? Oh, mama, <laughs> she's me. dog hell of shit, nasty Man. shit. I don't know how See, And we, you know how we was like, we know them verses? Y'all still don't know Nelly verse? <laughs> I know, that's what I'm like. But we you don't know the whole Trina verse, nigga, dude. Shit, Trina was going. Rap it right yeah, now. Uh, was a you can tell I'm not finna rap all that, Trina is this shit. Nelly? <laughs> your la- is this Nelly? He was talking a lot of shit at first, but you can see that he did, did it. Did it, yeah. yeah. You can see I ain't sweating. <laughs> you can call him up yourself and tell him I, I ain't get, get it. it. No, please don't confuse me, miss. But you can see I'm trying to put you on my Christmas, Christmas list. Yeah. <laughs> that shit <weird>. Dirty. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, I hope you ain't fitting by this, but I think your ass fine and shit. And, and that's straight up real talk. Okay. All bullshit.
bullshit aside, she replied, I, I like the little wild thing. thing. <laughs> Took place at my place. place. Now my place. place. It's, it's my place. place. Dirty. That shit was weak. <laughs> yeah, I'm done. Yeah, I'm done. He only gave him eight boards. I said eight boards. I was trying to see where it started, but it was like a little hook, and then it went into something. He gave that nigga eight boards, bro. Oh, uh, that's weak. hella funny. <laughs> <Y'all dumb. laughs> Nelly ain't boozy. The only reason it wasn't weak because Nelly said it. But we just said that verse and we didn't know say it. We didn't know who Nelly was. We just heard it. Who was that nigga, bro? Bro, it's a lot of niggas that were verses like that. That's a good point. Mm. If you were to just read it, that should be weak. No, I heard you that. You gotta verse. say it and they talk. You gotta throw the that's yeah, like, yeah, dirty. That shit too. Oh. <laughs> Let me in now. <laughs> I oh. was, now, oh, Nelly was the nigga. Yeah. Unle, unle, mama, I fuck with yeah, Nelly. Yeah. Yeah. Uh oh. Hey, that beat's still about the hardest beat probably ever mama, made huh? in rap history, bro. On mamas. I remember the first time I heard that beat drop, nigga. That shit fucked my little eleven year old world up, nigga. Nelly was that one for sure with all them blaps. It's a lot of legends for sure. Who, but who <laughs> he doing the verses? Nelly, uh, he went against Ludacris. The verses. That's huh? what it was on the phone. They need to redo a couple of them verses. I ain't yeah. gonna they lie. They need to give uh, Teddy Riley another shot. Cause his internet kept fucking up both times. That shit gonna fuck up again. His knee, gonna, <laughs> his knee <laughs> gonna fuck up in real nah, life. Yeah, it ain't gonna work. But them niggas too old. Sometimes I be wishing I could pick the songs. You know what I'm saying? The selections. Cause what was the best verses? I ain't gonna lie, that locks versus was, was. They should let the fans pick the the songs. Like the top ten songs that the fans pick, the artists will have to play it, you know? That would be good. Because some of these artists they don't really go with the flow sometimes. They just pick out the fo- um pick out any random songs they feel like. It was raw. Really? The locks would cause it just it felt like a nigga was finna get socked. <laughs> it was a real New York shit. Real New York. I felt like it was on the train. Like we was on the back, the last train full of niggas. And nigga, it was, it was, that was some real New York shit. shit. Yeah, bro. Like it just <laughs> felt gritty. Meanwhile, I felt like the, you know what I'm saying? The, uh, the Texas and Memphis one, I felt like it was. Why are they in Atlanta? Why are they oh, not? For real? You know what I'm saying? Like these people ain't really rocking with the shit. It ain't like oh, I wanted real? them to be. Y'all could have been anywhere. Where, where they was gonna have it at though? I think anywhere in Texas. Thought, I think anywhere they thought that was gonna be like Tennessee. Central... You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Anywhere in the middle, you could have that bitch. So it was in Atlanta, man. And it was like I hate that they had to keep telling the crowd, like you know what I'm saying? What's up, y'all? Like we in this bitch, like. Oh. Like, I have to tell them that they should know this shit. If yeah, that'd have been going dumb if it was in Texas. This nigga, like, I went up when they, JG, I'm over here. When they bought, when they dropped, <laughs> uh, uh, Kid I fuck with, uh, M-Ball, uh, what's the nigga, right. man? Hey, Ball and MJG. Them niggas go crazy. Life goes on. And on. They do that song? Did they do that shit? I been up. I been down. I been in. I been out. I was loved. I was hated. Bitch niggas try to toss me out. I been on. I been off. I been a worker. I been a boss. All the all the shit I ever been. I ever been salt. That nigga was busting. Same. And I know uh, that shit, nigga. I'm about to pull a kick down. <laughs> Lay down on the floor. floor. <laughs> Cheese and the money. money. Everybody got to go. <laughs> Say, that's what I'm saying. And Bun was showing hella love to you, you know, the pimp, you know what I'm saying, and playing uh-huh. his verses, but he wasn't rapping his until, like, near the end. I'm like, Bun, all your shit retarded. You got to go. Yeah. Like, I don't know. I just damn. But it was, was good. A... No, it was good. Like you but, know, the hits, the hits. But yeah. it's just like it would have went dumb if it was because they over here doing they songs and shit. You know what I'm saying? I could imagine they did that two short E40 uh, verses anywhere that else besides the That was one of my favorites best. too, though. Really? Yeah, yeah bro. Because that right shit was just a party. Yeah, that was on some drunk OG shit. Yeah, that shit was like a barbecue, bro. You had to. That wasn't one you just had to watch the whole time. Oh, you had to have that shit playing while you doing other shit. Oh, mama. Playing spades, dominoes, nigga. Oh, yeah, man. Say that you got say, it all. Hey! Love the way you play on Hey! Say that you got it all. Every day. Oh, my mama. Day. Oh, my mama. <laughs> that go crazy. Yeah. Oh, my mama. Shorty the pimp. I told them, I said, y'all got to do a remix that motherfucker and call it IG Ballers, nigga. Because it was nah. called Players Ball, nigga. And then it's like, nigga, it's the same concept, but nigga, niggas IG ballers now, nigga. Man, say, for 
Shout out, shout out versus too, nigga. I was on that motherfucker with my uh, OG Mark Curry. You understand yeah, me? Yeah, shout out Short. Versus. Shout out everybody. Uh, what was that your was cool. Uh, my favorite verses was uh, Gucci, 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 Gucci man at Jeezy. Jeezy that been was my a favorite solid rapper. Verse. Mm -hmm. Jeezy been my favorite rapper, that. nigga, for hell long. Man, so yeah, we like, did used to be on Jeezy. I Jeezy been my nigga. Jeezy. Yeah. What? Oh my mama! A so when food, they did that shit, I'm like, like nigga, because I wasn't able to, be, I was, I was never able to be a fan of Gucci because of Jeezy. Like that yeah. beef was so. If you was a fan of one, of, like yeah, you, had to pick you couldn't fuck yeah, with. I didn't know a lot of, yeah, I didn't nigga, know I didn't fuck with me. Gucci. I was fucking with Jeezy the whole shit. So I'm like, I never got to really fuck with him. So once Jeezy squashed it, like, bro, I'm not worried about that nigga. I'm like, all right, I get this nigga Gucci. I'm I mean, I, I had to jam Icy though. That bitch went up. Icy but man, that was, but that was, that on, was the same. on there. Yeah, I'm, but I said that's oh, probably I the most. Said, say that bitch was. Classy, that probably was like, the most historic moment to come out of the during the whole. The, during the whole beat Cause them niggas Was not supposed to be On stage ever That if lemonade it wasn't song for the I could deny that right. one Not for real <laughs> And the no. world being and shut down shit. And yeah. niggas probably Having time to reflect And do all that shit Yeah Niggas probably Would've never got On that stage ever. together mm -mm. And it still was Tension at first Jeezy was, Jeezy no. was ready for it Gucci just made his mind Like oh, I can do it <laughs> Cause Gucci was really Tripping the whole time Jeezy was like Chilling like, nigga, I'm a boss, nigga. Because Gucci argue really no dealt nigga. with the trauma of it. Yeah. You yeah, nigga, nigga, you try to end me. Yeah, I'm Ooh, Lord. I'm butt naked fucking. Y'all niggas gonna come in while I'm at my most vulnerable? <laughs> nah, that shit ain't, that shit ain't real. Ooh, shit. Yeah, nah, that, that, that was iconic, though. The Jeezy, uh, Gucci one. That shit went dumb. That one was good. Anything we gotta, uh, promote? What? Uh. Ah, what day? June 23rd, June 23rd, this month on the 23rd, North Hollywood, the Young OG Show is back. Come fuck with some Max. You understand me? Yeah. Huh? Spend, put money on blacks. <laughs> uh. And racks on racks on racks. Oh. <laughs> facts on facts on facts. And when you pull off, he, ah, ah, ah. <laughs> yeah. Rat, tat, 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 tat. <laughs> And a hellcat. <laughs> I think you rap better than me, Ted. I'm I just be saying shit. <laughs> I'm bunker rapping. I think I rap better as Sonic Bo. Just be Sonic Bo when you rap. I can't be Sonic Bo without the dress. <laughs> it's a whole thing. Yeah. Right? It's a bond. You got to yeah. turn into that nigga. I be had to put the dress on the studio. I try to make a song without the dress, and it just don't feel right. I be sounding I'll be like, nigga, this don't even feel right. You I need put to keep the dress it with you on. then, you know what I'm saying? So you can throw it on. On my mama. You know what I'm saying? On mama. Nah, all right, whatever. Young OG Show, June 23rd. Pull up on us. Show, 9 o'clock. It's a Thursday. You understand me? So make sure y'all get your tickets right now. The link is in the description or in the bio. You know what I'm saying? And if you're in Washington, D.C., I'm coming out there July 8th and 9th. I'm at the D.C. Lounge, DC. No, the DC Comedy Loft. I forgot the name of it right quick. <laughs> yeah, the DC Lounge. <laughs> <laughs> Man, it's in the bio. It's in my bio. <laughs> DC Comedy Loft. I got four shows. Pull up on the nigga, man. You we gonna have me. fun. Chocolate City. Chocolate City, baby. Let me rob beers every Friday. Nigga. Pull up. Uh -huh. We got Slink Johnson coming to uh, Oakland too. You understand me on the tenth, June tenth. Rob Benz. You know what I'm talking Pull about? Up. Ain't no online tickets. It ain't none of that. It's some y'all already know how we fuck with it up just there. Pull you understand up. me? Just pull up one of them. You know what I'm saying? It's a soft dub, but we trying to build a comedy club. You understand me? Who on these hoes? Yeah, on these hoes. I got some shit too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got mm -hmm. some shit. Yeah, that's the twenty third on a Thursday. I got something the twenty fifth. I'm in Bakersfield, the twenty fifth. Somewhere. Mm -hmm. But anyway, follow me, uh, <laughs> at Precious B Hall. You know what I'm saying? Precious B H A L L. That's on. I have all the shit on there because it's the most shit too. But you know, <laughs> thanks for having me and shit. Make sure you follow on these hoes podcast. You oh, know man, make sure. Where y'all gonna bring me and Teddy? We together. gonna come together. Yeah, all of us. Like all the fans been saying, they been wanting us to do a and podcast do together. A yeah, yes. I want to do a tour. I That's tour what I'm talking about. I was talking about a tour together. Can we do that? Yeah. We be talking about, but the Cali we gotta kick back on these hoes tour. Oh, oh my mama. Do we perform Cali or we, should we just talk shit? Both of them. Oh, well, we, we do two talk. shows a night, one podcast, one show. Yeah. Mm. Y'all put point. it on the comments. Mm. Tell us what should, what should we do? What city we should come to first? Mm. Yeah. 
Yeah. That'll be done. Yeah, we're going to put that together. For, for sure, for sure. I really uh, thank you. I love everybody. <laughs> Make sure y'all subscribe. I'll see y'all again. Wonderful podcast. I thoroughly enjoyed it. It went by pretty quickly. To be honest, it didn't really feel like an hour. I really enjoyed the conversation and the back and forth. And my mind just went on the classic Nelly song and everything like that. Now I get to listen to that song now. You know, back in the day, Nelly was considered one of the best. <laughs> Even some may consider it his prime was probably something close to Drake, if you think about it. But that's something for another story. But the podcast was really good. I really appreciate it. And I didn't know Precious had a podcast. I might have to check that out when I have the time. But this is Steph Riak. Until next time, this is your boss. I'm out of here.